15 K mark, and uh, we we'll should easily pass that this week. So uh, Marcus uh, is going to join us. Uh, it's his day for the quote of the day. Uh, so let's see what he's got for us. Got old. The reason why there is light in the world. Old Thomas Edison. Now uh, his story is. I failed my way to success. You got the little money signs on the side, just to let y'all know. So yeah, just because you know you get turned down by, you know, since we're in sales, just in case you get turned down by prospects or anybody you're trying to 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 close a sale on, just just keep on plugging away because the money will be rolling in eventually if you keep on going, keep on going, keep on going. And that's that's my quote of the day. Sounds good. So there's our quote of the day from the dirty kitchen. You guys use that to your advantage. Today, tell us about the hashtags. Hashtag, who's got my money? Hashtag, DK for Dirty Kitchen. Sounds good. Go ahead and post on those today. Let us know that you're watching. And thanks for watching as always. Check out our uh, Instagram at Alpha Graphics West Ave. You're always there beyond. Okay, so here is what I was thinking about all weekend. And it's how can we get more attention? Okay. Okay, so it's no secret uh, that we need to have a plan to get attention and money follows attention. So how can we get more money? By getting more attention, because we need people to know who we are. Um, so thinking about our three key business units, can you tell me what those are now that it's been a while? Our three units of business that we focus on. What do you, as far as? As the, the cycle, so we have, how do we get people into our in leads? How do we? I'll handle do. them while we're working with them and then what do we do when the job's done we have those three units it's the the follow-up well, or, or no is it the uh, secure initial conversation no those are all part of the three main units the before during and the after units okay before during after units. yeah so the before again is where we do all of our leads how what we do to get uh, get People to come in for quotes, leads, SEM, SEO, bag drops, Instagram Live, all that stuff. So that's right before. The during is when we what we do while we're working with them. Make sure that they're having a great experience, okay. efficient, making it easy for them. And then the after is after we gave them the product, finished the service. Um, we're gonna follow them up and keep them in the pipeline and not just forget about them. So those are our three main units that everything else falls somewhere within. So describing it that way, if we're trying to get attention, which of those three units we're getting attention fall under? Before. Yeah, the before units. So uh, just a few ways to get attention that we're mostly doing all these, but it's just a fresh reminder. So uh, we're doing bag drops. We're doing social media. Uh, we're being the first people to answer a quote back when we have people going to us with quote requests. We're doing value-added follow-up, not just lame follow-up, but we're doing the Bafu. Uh, we're also following up till someone dies, so that gets their attention, even if they like don't really want to do business with us. Even if we still keep following up, and they're like, it's getting their attention, right? Even if it's not necessarily they're happy about it, it's still catching their eye. And then also we're adding upfront value, so we're doing that stuff where we're giving people, you know, stuff like these videos where they can use the same tips and tricks and doing things like the free design and all of that stuff, adding upfront value before we ever get a penny from the from the clients. Um, so there's three main steps to get attention. So the first one is we have to make ourselves known. So I think we're doing a pretty good job of that. It also helps that we're part of a franchise because people can associate Alpha Graphics, the, the name brand. Um, we're obviously putting out lots of social media. We're using our hashtags. We're getting people to know who we are um, through friend to friend contact like you just had this weekend at the, at the show. All of that stuff is making ourselves known because if we don't go tell people about us, then it's going to be a lot smaller audience if they have to come to us without us letting them know who we are. And then the next way we can get attention, number two, is we're going to deliver what people need. So when they come in, they have something they need, we're actually going to get it to them and get it done. And that's going to get their attention like, wow, these guys really helped me out. So if we can make ourselves known, deliver what's needed, the last thing we can do is uh, improve ourselves personally every day. So that's going to help us get attention because we're going to be better as a individuals and we're going to come in with new uh, tactics, strategies, tips and tricks to uh, expand our businesses personally and as, as a team here in the Dirty Kitchen, right? Yes, sir. So, 
nobody else, I mean, when, we're making, when I talk about making ourselves known, things like the LinkedIn, the Instagram, YouTube, you put your LinkedIn picture up the other day, I saw that, <coughs> so you're working on that, building it out. Um, we're doing all the YouTubes, Facebook, Twitter's lacking a little bit. Uh, I, I just I just never understood Twitter. I, I'm putting a lot of stuff out, but it just doesn't really gain traction, but I'm probably just not using it right, but that's okay, we'll figure that part of it out. Um, but the thing that I've really noticed is that nobody else in the printing space is doing anything like this. So I've been looking all over trying to find something similar printing wise. I mean, there's lots of people doing what we do right now in other stuff, mm -hmm. but nobody printing. So I think it might take a lot, little time for it to catch on. Like I said, we have put out eight videos this weekend and they're all zero views. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and this one will be another one soon, but. Um, it's all right. Yes. It's all right. But we're building that base we're building content, so when people do say like, oh, this is interesting, they have something, they have lots of stuff to jump into and, and keep them occupied and keep them coming back, because they're gonna be like, oh, wow, why? Yes, you know, like, oh, wow, look at all this. There's 10,000 yeah. videos yeah, on here. Yeah, the same thing that's happened to me. Like, I've discovered people, exactly, and I've discovered people, and I'm like, oh, I like that, and I'm like, oh, he has this book. Oh, there's this YouTube show. Oh, wow. And then all of a sudden, next thing you know, you're trying to get all of the, the Next thing you know, somebody's going to be like, hey, you're Marcus yeah. underscore Beverly 27. It's <laughs> oh, just like, really? Yeah. Tell me about my Instagram name. Right? Why don't you? I think it's going to happen for us. So, and the thing is that we're, so we're doing that for ourselves personally. Like you said, they're going to recognize us hopefully. And they're also building and adding value to the community. Mm -hmm. We're giving out good stuff, helping people. And also, just for the business itself, we're uh, building up goodwill for the business, and we're helping people know that we're the authority and the preeminent choice for print, graphic design, marketing, and signs. So that's all just making ourselves known. So then just in the point two, so delivering what's needed so we can build attention and gain recognition by delivering a first-class experience and a high-quality product. So I think when you do go somewhere and pay money and have a great experience, that gets your attention. Oh yeah, I'm always gonna come, come back. back. Yeah. yeah, because you're like, oh wow, that actually was enjoyable and I got my money's worth. And then uh, by adding the value and getting people what they need, we're gonna build loyalty. We're gonna generate good reviews, hopefully, with our Yelp and stuff like that. Like that guy on Friday said, hey, you know what? I wanna put a great review on Yelp because you guys helped me out with a pinch. And then uh, that also is hopefully gonna help generate referrals from people just saying, hey, I had a good experience here. Go talk to my guy Marcus, and I know he helped me, so he should be able to help you. And then uh, that'll build us what we get, a uh, thing I think Ken Blanchard, he's an older business guy, but he called it a raving fan client. So that's people who just can't wait to tell people about their experience, how good you are, and hey, go check these guys out, and they become raving fans, and they're just ready, waiting, Anytime they need your services, they're like, oh yeah, I get to get, I'm excited to go in and talk to Marcus yeah. at Alpha Graphics today. Like or even Jesse, if it's, watch Jesse when he gets those Yeah, cars, exactly. he's going to be like, oh man, what can I do next that's going to be cool and exciting. Same with my 3X people. They were like, oh man, we love the cards, what else can we do? So I said, how about the 3X postcards? Yes, we want those. And now they just love every, oh, I'm ready for new cards, can you make us some more? So that's a raving fan client. And then we already have this skill, but improving ourselves every day. Uh, we're doing it as a group in here. We're having it. We're improving ourselves right now, learning and talking over this stuff together. And uh, we're reading books. Mm -hmm. uh, we're doing our sales meetings. We're getting practice through experience, through quoting, through sales calls, through phone calls, through with counter sales. Um, we've got our quote of the day here, which we're using to give us inspiration for success. And the more we up our personal abilities, then we naturally will grow the skills of our business and ourselves. And it's just a nice big circle that all leads to good things from what I've experienced in the past, and I'm sure you have too. Oh, yes. Um, so those are our three points. So we want to get ourselves known, deliver what's needed, and improve ourselves personally every day. It's going to get us attention, and money follows attention. Yes, it does. So let's make it happen this week. Monday. Yes, it does. All right. That's all I got for us. That was a good one. I like this meeting. This Short, meeting. sweet, and powerful. Yes, it was. So let's, I'm going to commit to putting out more uh, social media posts this week. So Gary Vee said you should be putting out at least seven pieces of content a day. That sounds about right. That's a lot. But every time I put content out, we gain six, seven followers. And maybe we lose three, but we retain two. So if I can, or even I need your help too, but if we can pump out seven pieces a day. Okay. That King Escape picture, simple, he took it. 
and we got like 30 likes on that. Really? Yeah, do you look at it? No, no. We had a whole bunch of likes and... I wasn't, uh, I wasn't really active on social media this weekend. They, well, the Kosa guy commented on it, he put like four hearts and a bunch of fire flames. Yeah. Um, so it doesn't have to be pretty, right? Just that he took a simple picture of a graphic and I think the people thought the graphic was cool. Yeah. And it just kind of got lots of likes, so that was awesome. So let's try and get attention this week. All right. What can we do to get some more attention? Grab some, say, hey, we're over here, and we're here to help you, so what can we do? Just let us know, we'll make it happen, easy. And uh, so since we haven't been saying it a lot, uh, follow us, Alpha Graphics, West Ave Instagram, Facebook, AG West Ave, as well as Twitter. And uh, if you're liking these videos that we're bringing out to you, make sure you share it with your friends and uh, put it out there. And if we're adding value, like, comment, and subscribe and let us know what you think. If they suck too, or if we could do something better, let us know that as well. We'd appreciate it. So you guys have an awesome day.